What up, folks? This is Wiley Warlock, and we are back with some more Bloodborne. Yes, sir. All right, so we got all of these Blood Echoes here. We're going to spin these. I don't want to level up no more. I think we're, we're pretty much at a, at a decent level to take on the rest of the game, hopefully. So we're going to take these Blood Echoes and buy a bunch of bullshit. Oh, my God. We can buy that many Blood Vials. I don't know if I want to buy that many Blood Vials. We'll buy 100. How about that? 100. Put that in our storage. All right, uh, Quicksilver bullets. We won't buy those. Um, Molotovs, yes. Let's buy some Molotovs. We'll buy 30. Okay. Um, poison knives. We'll buy 30 of those. And, hmm. I've been getting a lot of use out of the bone marrow ash, to be honest. Might want to buy some more of those. Uh, no, we'll buy sedatives, because we're not done using sedatives. So we'll buy about 15. Okay, so we got 602 blood echoes left. We'll take that and buy... Hmm. How about some throwing knives? We'll buy six throwing knives, okay. So that works. All our blood echoes are gone. Let's see if we have any more uh, throwing knives in our storage. I'm not quite sure. Oh, I only got 182. I must have been running through. Quicksilver bullets only 56. Okay, sedatives 24. Molotovs 53. Poison knives. Okay, yeah, we ran out of throwing knives. It's all good. Let's see if German is back here finally. He's been missing our whole game. And he is not. So fuck his ass. Not literally. Just fuck him. Okay, we're gonna head back to Unseen Village. Finish off what we were doing there. Uh, I believe it's the Unseen Headstone. Here we are. Yargul Chapel. So we got past like a lot of bullshit in one area. But we, we're not done. The, the rest of this, uh, this entire area is full of shit. We're gonna come up on one of uh, one of my top ten creepiest enemies. It's pretty high up on the list. We'll see it when we get to it. Anybody who's played the game, they know what I'm talking about. Creepiest enemy. All right. So we had Yargo Chapel. We had to run down here and uh, run past all these witches. They just, they got their back turned waiting for somebody to come down these steps. Uh, we've already passed you, bitches. Okay, so as you can see, you might, I don't know if you could tell, but when we got kidnapped and we, we found the lamp, this, that over there is that lamp that we had found. And down here with some uh, some snatches. Snatches seem to be gone. I don't know where the snatches are. They're no longer here. Okay. So we got a bell ringer. Let's see if we can. Uh, probably be better to drop on instead of using these. They're kind of shorter. Okay, he's gone. Get that. Come on, doggies. Okay, take the dogs out. Huh. Okay, so here's the bell ringer in this corner here. I never knew she was here. Fuck, missed him. Fuck you, man. Can you please turn back to that? There we go. Okay. Yeah. 
Yep, that's exactly what you did. You died. Huh. Okay. I don't know. This area doesn't look familiar to me. I mean, that looks familiar. I think I know where that, where that is. That leads to the side entrance uh, to the uh, prison where you fight Dark Beast Parl, it looks like. Yeah. That's what that is. But I didn't know there was a door over there. It leads to nothing, most likely. Okay, so this area, the snatches are gone. The lamp is broken. They broke our fucking lamp. These fucking assholes. And they've been replaced with hunters. Now this area can be bullshit. The uh the best the best option is to try to fight them one on one. Let me see, is this door open? It is open. Alright. So that's kinda like why you want that door to be open uh when you first come in here. So you can just like try to sneak past these hunters if you're in a sneaking mood. I'm not really a sneaking type. Well, I mean I am, but it's more of assassination. So we got that. We're gonna run up here. He's probably gonna follow us, hopefully. Oh, they're all gonna follow us. There's three of them here. You don't see the third one because he's on the steps. But get him down here. Shit, I had him too. We didn't have this guy. What are you doing? This guy. Oh my god, the other hunter came from behind me. Oh my god, they're cheating. They're cheating. Where'd he come from? Alright, we're just gonna run out. Don't get stuck by the door. Alright, so we're gonna run out here. See if we can. Uh, we took out one without dying, thankfully. Um, we could have went better. Guys with the chains are so fucking hard to uh, parry. I don't know why. All right, so he, are they gonna both come that way? I don't know where the other hunter is. That's one. Where's the other one? He seems to be stuck there. We're going to try to sneak up on him. See if we can't do it with the uh with our weapon transform. Got him. He's got a cannon. You gotta be careful with him. Okay, let's see here. He does it again. Yeah. yeah, so the hunters can't do shit when you like 
doing beast mode on him. All right, Madman's knowledge. Quick silver bullets. Okay, so there's one more. We're gonna switch to our our, our weapon here. So. He's chilling on the steps, so we're gonna come around this way and uh, ruin his day a little bit. It's a lot easier when you're trying to when you're just taking on one. Trying to take on two, three, but fuck that shit. almost dead. Peace out. More Madman's knowledge. Let's go ahead and pop these Madman knowledge. I think we got enough. We got a lot. Let's pop that. Use multiple. 17. What else we got? We got some uh, great ones wisdom. All right. Is there an enemy right here? No. All right. So we're going to come down the steps here. See what else lies in wait. Let's change out some of this shit. Numb and mist we don't need. Uh, keep the beast roar. It's pretty good. Um, don't need sedatives quite yet. Um, it, well, I guess the weapons I'm using, I can't really... Can't, I can't use fire paper with the weapons I have, so we don't need that. Um, we'll put Tiny Tonitras here. And um, I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. So, let's keep moving. This fucking creature. Disgusting. Not really creepy. I mean, it is if you've seen it in real life. Like, it's a fucking scourge beast or werewolf made out of body parts. Like this shit is disgusting. Disgusting. Alright, so Madmen toil surreptitiously in rituals to beckon the moon, uncovering their secrets. So the moon has been beckoned. Secrets are being uncovered. Come down here. Okay, what's this say? Remember friend. It's probably for the, uh, for the lady there who's no longer there. She's going crazy at the cathedral ward. And look what we have here. What happened to you? Like, y'all were... Y'all were, like, badass, man. And now you just laid out. Fucked up. Fucked... Somebody fucked you up, man. Who, who could have fucked them up? Who could have fucked them up? Was it the werewolf? Y'all got the wolf effect. If you're not familiar with what the warp effect is, it's a. Uh, I'm not a big Star Trek fan, but I, I like I like uh, reading like TV tropes, and uh, I think Worf was a uh, Worf was a character on there, right? I remember Worf. Anyway, he's supposed to be like the warp effect is when you take a badass character, and uh, who's known for being badass, and to establish another character's badassery you have uh you have warp take a beating to him basically 
So it's kind of like taking a badass character. That's how you know the character is badass because a tough character gets his ass whipped by this guy. So that's supposed to be like a character defining moment. It's called the warp effect. It's pretty interesting. So Snatchers seem to have gotten the warp effect. Which as you see, they'll be laid out all over the place. Okay, there's another scourge beast in here. I didn't want to. Uh, I didn't want to go through that one door because we can just come here and see him. Okay, he's got his back turned. He's gonna turn around. It's cool. Oh, he's fast. He's fast. Oh. There we go. There we go. Okay, he's out the paint. I, I believe there might be another one in here. Maybe. Gotta be careful. Another snatcher laid the fuck out. Feel sorry for these guys. Not really. They're giving me bloodstone chunks. Gonna need that to level up the Jakage. We can get it to level nine now with all these, with everything that they're giving us. Um. So, yeah. Where is that door at? So the door is over there somewhere. So this is where we were earlier, looking up over here, looking, looking down. Okay. So we can continue. Okay, and you'll see what we have here. Well, before we do that, let's kill. There's a there's a bell ringer up here. We got to get rid of her. Run past him. She's just chilling in the corner here. bell ring is over here Ugh. all right so they're taken care of now there is a room that we couldn't really access it was an elevator we couldn't access over here oh forgot about you Now we can access it. Yep, that is a secret area. We will be coming to it. So now we're back out at the at the beginning. So we can start here when we die. We could just transport to that um that uh that lamp. We can just come down here to skip all this bullshit. We're gonna go there, don't worry. I just I wanna uh wanna come down here. There's a lot of activity going on here. There's lots of activity. Alright, so right there, this this bullshit right here, this is horse shit. This guy. Top 10 previous enemies. I believe they're number three on my list. Yeah, look, 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 look at it. Look, look I can't even get the words out. This shit is disgusting. Uh, cramped coffins is what they call them. Fucking disgusting. Look at this shit. Top 10 previous enemies. They're number three. Number two. Two would be Winter Lanterns, and I believe number one, and I, I've replaced them. I've switched out the, uh, the the two and the one, but the Labyrinth Madmen remind me of the Lady from the Ring. They're number one. Oh, I, I, I motherfucker. That's right, then.
not that hard. I mean, they hit hard, but uh, I think we're, we're pretty much at a good level to uh, jump scares. You can use this thing to... Uh... Okay. All right, I didn't really do much. All right. So some kind of bullshit ritual is going on. It sucks to be that guy, man. Beast hunter. Uh, that was a lot. All right, so this part right here can be some bullshit. Uh, we just gonna pull. Try to pull one. Look at another snatcher. But they all seem to carry bloodstone chunks. Okay, I think we got somebody's attention. Don't jump in front of him. All right. Get him out the paint. We can't pull another one. I think there's four of them. So we took out one. That's two. Oh, maybe there's only three. It looks like there was more. We could probably sneak up on him. Not like we can backstab him. Oh, don't run into the fire. All right. Come on, come on, come on. Good. So he's taken care of. Okay. So if we come down here, I'm I don't think I'm gonna fight all these guys. There's no Well, maybe maybe we should. They seem to be giving us some good items here. Behold the pale blood sky. So now shit starting to make sense a little bit. When you first read that, uh, you read that message when you come here, if you come here, it doesn't really make a lot of sense. A lot of things don't make a lot of sense until this part in the game. Uh, oh, 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 oh. So he got me. Just horse shit. Um, so what are we going to do? We're going to... Where we're at, we're at the uh, Yargul Unseen Chapel. Yeah, we're still here. We're going to try to run past all these guys. Try to get our our, our our health back. Try to get our health back. Oh, he hurt. Oh my God.
All right, so we fared better. Let's uh, we don't even have to go through this area, but I feel I feel kind of shitty if I don't I don't at least pay back in kind the guys who killed me. So we have to do that. We have to. Not about to die again. Kick rock with that shit. Where's the other one? Come on! Bring your ass here! Bring your ass here! Still shot me. Come on. Okay, I'm just gonna skip. Come on. Wow. Fuck out my face. Running past you. Don't got time. I'm gonna run down here. This is the guy that killed me. take a little break here I'm gonna uh, head back to the hunter's dream buy a couple more items or stock up on some items and when we come back we're gonna take we're gonna take on the boss here we're gonna use that little passage passageway that we seen we're gonna take on the boss